Hey guys, Vegan Rush from RV here, back in our video, and today I'm back with more Persona 5 Royal. A lot of us, oh my god, in the lap. In the last episode, shit went down with Akechi, with Nijima, that whole uh, Akira's dead, but actually he's not because we used the metaverse to trick Akechi somehow. Really, really convoluted stuff. But, uh,. Hey, we found out who the master- we found out, one, who the true culprit behind the, uh, mental shutdowns was, Goro Akechi, and two, we found out who the mastermind behind Akechi's actions is, and that is this man right here. That sounds familiar. Yeah, I bet our name really does sound familiar to you, huh, you son of a bitch? It's me, Akechi. Enter. That's the death certificate of the principal offender, correct? Is there a problem with it? No, not at all. No, nothing in particular. More importantly, you've done well with regard to the prosecutors. The cause of death for the SIU director has been settled as a stroke. Ah. I had him work quite substantially on forging evidence. His loss should be mourned. It was thanks to his efforts that I could enter the Phantom Thieves interrogation room, too. The SIU is in disarray with his death. I'll take my time choosing a successor after the elections. At any rate, I'm now praised as a hero, and I owe it all to the Phantom Thieves. All possible hindrances are now gone. There's no doubt that this election is mine. Yeah, the only reason he did all that shit with mental shutdowns is to win the election. <laughs> Crazy, huh? Crazy. And on to our next story. The snap election for the House of Representatives. Oh boy. Discussion is swirling around potential nominees as the deadline for candidacy announcement nears. Candidates will announce on the 23rd of this month, while voting will be held on the 18th of next. Gee, that almost sounds like a deadline. Election time? Eh, don't matter to us. It's not like we can vote in him yet anyways. Yet. Why don't we resume our conversation? Yeah, thanks for turning that off. Well, the Phantom Thieves are back together. We can finally take it to Akechi and the bastard back in him. Not exactly. Have you figured out who's behind all this? Akechi accidentally let that slip after the murder. He said, Shido-san. Shido? It feels like I've heard that somewhere. So true, that name should be familiar to you. He is unmistakably a man of power if he has such strong connections to the police. Shido? Could it be Masayoshi Shido? Uh, who? Oh yeah, he's definitely heard that name. I believe he's a politician. Remember Ryuji? You said his speech was too loud. Because it was. For real? It's certainly possible that Shido is the mastermind. Huh? What do you mean? Do you have some kind of evidence? Or any sort of inkling? Whatever. Nothing material. However, there are various conditions which align with that possibility. Would be conditions being? First, he would profit from damage done to the current administration by the psychotic breakdowns. He's maintained a negative stance toward the Phantom Thieves and has gained tremendous popularity. On top of that, he'll most likely become the next Prime Minister if he wins this upcoming election. No! Did he set us up with that election in mind? Probably! If he is behind all this, that would be in stark opposition to his honest public image. So his current position and popularity is just him benefiting from the mental collapses. Not just that, but the Phantom Thieves as well. We'll make him have a change of heart, no matter what it takes. Well, hold on, that's not as easy as it sounds, you know. Um. <sighs> Sojuro? What is the matter? You know that name? I had a feeling he was wrapped up in all this. Just based on the connections I had from my previous job. I think the one who crushed Wakaba's research and confiscated her materials was probably Shido. From the moment Wakaba died, I had a hunch he was involved. Crazy how hunches could turn out to be right half the time, huh? But there wasn't anything I could do. So I chose to protect Futaba and went into hiding. 
Why didn't you say that sooner? Well, he didn't want... Shino was a nobody before this. To us, at least. I'd definitely gone after him if I had. That's also true. He would have just killed all of you, no doubt. That's what he usually does to people who get in his way. You saw how that's happened before. I was looking into the mental shutdown cases. I, like, before Futaba's mother. It was then that I accidentally stumbled upon government research regarding the psychotic breakdowns. So I tracked down the whereabouts of that research data and met with the associated parties. One of them being Shida? The boss was one of those parties. I would never have imagined all of this was connected. Oh, Sojo was one of those parties. The mental shutdowns, psychotic breakdowns, Shido, and even the Phantom Thieves' actions. Way back when, Shido kept saying he was going to be Prime Minister one day. Nobody believed him, though. And that's why he's doing this shit? What's going to happen to this country if Shido becomes Prime Minister? What about the world? Well, yeah. The issue is simpler than that. Simpler how? This is nothing more than yet another selfish adult trying to impose his will on the public. Yeah, but it's crazy connections. You gotta expose that rotten bastard! He's got crazy connections, though. Yeah, we'll do it like always. Then let's check the nav. Masayoshi Shido, the guy running for prime minister. Yeah. Uh. A hit. Well, duh. Ain't a surprise he has one. Well, now we gotta figure out the specifics, you know. Where would the location be? What kind of things go through a politician's head? Mm -hmm. A lot of stuff. I always think of dirty money and shady actions. Besides that. <laughs> what does he do? Uh, and where? We don't got a clue about this guy's life. He's a politician. Half his re half his history is probably on the internet somewhere. His palace must be somewhere that politicians frequent. Any ideas? Uh, the diet building. Perfect. We got a hit. How arrogant must he be to see himself as the ruler of the diet building? He did say he was going to be prime minister at any cost. Our next target's the big shot politician Masayo Shishido. We're gonna do this, right? We have to, don't we? Wait, what about- yeah, what about Akechi? No need to waste time with him, we just gotta hit the head. Nah, but like, he's Nobody crazy strong, you know. Of course! He will be a worthy opponent. Let's win this together. Time for revenge. Alright. And it's unanimous. All we gotta do now is figure out what he thinks that diet building place is. So that's the app that allowed me to enter the metaverse. Kinda. Kinda. An old fart like me can't wrap his head around all this stuff. Don't worry, Sojuro. We'll have to deal with this before election day, December 18th. That means we need it done by the 17th. <sighs> oh boy. It's best we hurry before they discover there's no body in the morgue. Right. Should we start tomorrow then? We can meet at the diet building after school. You mean the school that I can't go to anymore? That reminds me. What are you gonna do about school? You can't show up if you're supposed to be dead. That's true. Miss Kawakami said he went back home for family reasons. Perfect. That's what I told the school. Man, so much you on Kawakami covering for us. Don't let him find out you're alive then, alright? This whole thing would be for nothing. We know. Does nobody think it's suspicious that we disappear from school as soon as they say on the news that the Phantom Thieves leader is dead? Does no one connect those dots? What do you mean? This operation had another purpose outside of escaping Akechi's clutches. Shido <sighs> tried to place all the blame on the Phantom Thieves and deceive the public at the same time. He has ruined countless lives and even made Goro Akechi a student a minor with assassinations. A mere change of heart is too lenient a sentence for such an abominable criminal. We'll be making use of the police statement that the leader of the Phantom Thieves committed suicide. Our leader, who is presumed dead, will come out of hiding to deliver a grand statement. He'll say he has escaped prison, not committed suicide, and was in fact almost killed by a criminal. <laughs> Crazy plan. Mental. You guys thought through all this stuff too. We thought through a lot. We're smarter than you think, Sojuro. We're intellectuals, you know. Well, maybe not you. That's why you needed such a daring trick as getting captured and appearing to be killed. 
What frightening teenagers. Yeah. That's why you don't mess with teenagers. Don't fuck around with them. They'll ruin you. A true battle. Well, Has some of them will. Begun. Some of them will threaten to ruin you, but then they just sound pathetic. We won the first round, but we must stay on our toes. Yeah. This ain't the time to be celebrating. You gotta be real careful. These people tried to trap and kill us. There is no end to their inhuman, conniving nature. We will need to be prepared for whatever may come our way. All right. So yeah. I finally made it this far. It's already been two and a half years since we met. And Akechi's a third year in high school, meaning he's been doing shit with Shido since his first year of high school. Back then, you were in the media's attention as a young politician who could rise up against bureaucracy. I don't know why that made me think of Hamilton. Because of that. I do know why, but it made me think of Hamilton. tried to tie you up in scandal. To think I would fall for the ruse schemed by those decrepit fools in power. I recall that's when you came to me. You promoted yourself saying you had special powers. There is no reason for them to reminisce over this shit. They're only doing this to give us a backstory behind Shido and Akechi. If it wasn't for the research on cognition that I dabbled in, I would have thought you Dabbled in, he says. I made those troublesome opponents psychotic and erased any trace of that scandal. Who'd think that tampering with a person's heart could trigger a psychotic lapse or mental shutdown? And when someone like that said he'd support me, I had suspected there'd be an ulterior motive. It's because I sympathized with your aspiring ideology. Uh-huh. I believed that your ideals needed to be achieved for the sake of the country's future. He also wanted to be famous ace detective. Well, my faith in you was precisely why I pulled the plug on that research. I only need you using that power. It'd be troublesome if someone else uncovered how it works. Yeah, I guess it would. Wakaba Ishiki, was it? That researcher. Ah, fuck! Wakaba Ishiki, was it? That researcher. She wouldn't have had to die if she just complied. Any suspicions should be snubbed out. Even the smallest doubt must be severed at the root. Suspicion. Whoops! <laughs> well, wow, I really messed things up here. Prosecutor's office director on our side until recently. Astounding, isn't it? To think the director himself often forged evidence to secure his promotion. It's not a surprise, really. A lot of she people do that. He was quite surprised when you confronted him about it. He didn't know who leaked that information. Who would have thought it was Goro Akechi? Well, I got that out of his shadow, so technically speaking, he did it himself. This country's affairs have become stagnant. The political world is filled with old men who only act to preserve their own vested interests. I really doubt you're that young, buddy. General, you're running for prime minister. In such political affairs and don't even bother. Only ruin awaits us. Sounds like Eeyore. I must agree. There's no need to be ruined along with such incompetent fools. I will lead this country to its revival. Those who get in the way must be eliminated at times. That's the correct way to use the metaverse. I don't think Still, so, but okay. It would stand out if there were continuous deaths and scandals with your political rivals. Yeah, people would start thinking you hired the fan of these to do shit. Which is why I made them suspects. Prosecute the targets that I turn psychotic, and solve them as cases unrelated to you. And thus, the charismatic ace detective was born. Thanks to your efforts, my clean image remains untarnished, and I've monopolized public opinion. Uh-huh. Once I gained the public sentiment, collaborators from all sectors began approaching me on their own. The police were no exception. With their management in my pocket, keeping them in check was easy. When the Phantom Thieves emerged, I thought things might become somewhat troublesome. And they were just brats once we looked into it. All we needed to do was lay the blame on them. When you told me that, I knew then that you were the better man. Their popularity was a bit beyond my expectations. But flipping it made the negative press stronger. Also, wait, another thing! They mentioned on the news that the leader of the Band of Thieves has a previous record of assault and is a minor. Has 
Has no one at school put two and two together and is like, oh, Akira is the leader of the fan of thieves. He's gone missing. He's a minor. He has a record for assault. And the fan of thieves started at Shujin Academy. Has no one at Shujin put that together? That, oh, maybe Akira is the leader of the fan of thieves and maybe the friends that he always hangs out with on a daily basis are fan of thieves as well? Has no one put that together? Or, okay. After that, all I had to do Let's just call it a plot convenience call today. I've been gaining more supporters since. The current administration is dead with ongoing scandals. Never mind the fact that they're my doing. Even the government parties have begun splitting up. And they're dissolving just as planned. <laughs> the time has finally come. Just a little more and I will take the seat of Prime Minister. Yeah, all this just to become Prime Minister. However, inauguration isn't my goal. That's when everything truly begins. I'll make this country rich for the sake of its selfish and ignorant masses who can only rely on others. In other words, you're creating a powerful country that can compete with the world. History repeats itself, I guess. The public History will always be itself. And, follows me. and for that, some sacrifices can't be avoided. That is my duty as the chosen one. Your assistance has been very influential in making my plans proceed smoothly. When I become Prime Minister, I'll grant whatever wish you want. With this most recent case, my name has become known across the country. Perhaps even the world. Probably. Surely my story will be passed down as a hero who won against monsters that could control people's hearts. Quote unquote monsters. I believe I'll lay low and devote myself to my studies. A bit late for that, I ain't it? suppose with your age, you wouldn't come up with debauched desires. I am thinking about the future, though. Yeah, this shit, this stuff is real fucked well, up. Looks like, put this. looks like things have finally settled down. Life's gonna get real busy for you starting tomorrow, right? Get some rest. Well, I guess busy is one day you could put it. We're not really gonna be able to do anything because we're in hiding. So. Oh, by the way, the police report on your death isn't gonna show up at your school, no need to worry. It seems prosecutor, you need, prosecutor Nijima worked out some kind of deal with the higher ups or something. I mean, they haven't even said anything to me, even. As long as you stay quiet, well, you'll be fine. And how do I put And I guess this? if they ha reported your death now, they'd basically be saying you were a fan of thief. They can't really go announcing what the fan of thieves are, so I'm sure they'll avoid that. Yeah, let's hope for that. Um... At any rate, I'm glad you're back safe and sound. But even that's putting it too lightly. You had it rough in there, didn't you? Don't worry about Sorry. it. The catcher was after you all along. I knew it was risky, but we had no choice but to depend on him. But thanks to your tenacity, you were able to fool him. It's payback time. Let's make him regret underestimating fan of thieves. Oh yeah, no, we definitely will. Remember how I hijacked your phone during the school trip? That kind of came in handy. Did it now? <laughs> how so? Well, remember how I put that wiretap app in Akechi's phone? Yeah. Basically, that let me see GPS info for two phones, yours and his. Ooh. I'd be able to tell the precise moment Sai Nijima, who had your phone, ran into Akechi. Perfect. And I saw my chance, and beep, sent the signal to activate the Metaverse Navigator. But there was a chance they'd just pass each other without saying a single word. <laughs> That's why we needed you to tell Sai Nijima to show the phone to Akechi. Aha. You need to stop them long enough this for you to activate still surprises it. surprises me no matter how many times I hear it. Aren't you the one to formulate the plan? Oh no, it was, the metaverse yeah. Nav. It's a mysterious app after all. But you know how it has that bookmark function? All you have to do is push the button. So you coded something that pushed the button Thinking for you. I think he was pushing that button was totally doable. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? <laughs> yeah. You're real good at this, Futaba. It may not have looked like it, but everyone else was risking their lives too. Though there's no doubt you were the most at risk. I mean, you actually got arrested. Yeah, I am beat up by all the cops uh, there. It seems like all the drugs and stuff made you forget the details of the plan. Yeah. Want me to explain how it all went down? It might take a bit. Yeah, let's have you explain Since things here. the rest of us didn't get captured, we had to act. Yeah. We had to pretend we never wanted you to get arrested. Pretend the suicide news was a real shock. Basically, we had to act like we didn't know anything, 24-7. 
The enemy knows who we are, so we couldn't let our guard down even once while you were gone. If they had people watching us and realized what our plan was, they would have killed you immediately. Want to hear more? Sure. Another tough part was figuring out how to get Sai Nijima and Akechi back from the Metaverse. In order to return to reality, you have to go back to the point where you came into the Metaverse. So, Sai and Akechi had to go through where the nav was activated, as in, the hall where they met. Akechi would just come back the same way after the assassination. The real issue was Sai Nijima. We needed to stop her for a moment before she headed back toward the interrogation room. But nothing can be sent to a phone inside a palace. So, I had to program the messages in beforehand. Ooh. In doing so, I made it seem like the messages were coming at that exact moment in time. So, when Sai was like, how do they know I have this phone? Those are just pre-programmed? That's real that cool. It was kind of last minute, so I had to pull an all-nighter trying to get it set up. Yeah, you did seem really exhausted. I'm really on a roll here. Want to hear some more? Sure. Let me see. Another problematic thing was... Oh yeah, tying a catchy up. That was really tough. What? Uh, I obviously don't mean the real Akechi. Even if we could do that, it would ruin our plan. Cognitive Akechi? The one we had to tie up was Sai Nijima's Cognitive Akechi. What? This part's really complicated. I know you're tired. Are you sure you want to hear all of this now? I wasn't even aware that she had- Yes! I wasn't even aware that she had a cognitive version of Akechi in her palace. Well, we needed to lure Akechi into Sai Nijima's palace and have him kill the cognitive version. But... Akechi would have entered the palace immediately after meeting Sai Nijima in the hallway, right? Yeah. Because of that, there was a pretty decent chance he'd run into the cognitive Akechi. Uh-huh. And if that happened, Akechi would have totally realized we'd lured him into the palace. So y'all went in and tied that up? Possibility ...until the night before the assassination. Oh. Makoto realized in the middle of the night that it was a huge mess trying to figure out what to do. In the end... We chose to sneak into the metaverse while the plan was happening to tie up the cognition. Seriously? So while I was getting roughed up by the cops, y'all snuck into the metaverse and tied up Kaido Makechi? God damn, you guys. Mental, all because of you. Because told Sai to show him the phone, we expected her to chat with him for at least a bit. So, we had a few minutes to strike after the cognitive Akechi showed up, but before the nav activated. It was Operation Tie Him Up! Though it wasn't really much of an operation in the end. I doubt it was that hard. Thankfully, Sai Nijima didn't know his true nature, so the ah. one that appeared was an ordinary kid. And it was pretty simple surrounding him, knocking him out, and tossing him on another floor. I want to see that, man! I want to see that! The man, watching Makoto's skill was super amazing. I guess she does use Knuckles as her weapon. Yeah, but she's also trained in Aikido. That might Basically, help. Basically, what I'm trying to say is, appreciate what everyone else did. Oh, no, we definitely do. I just can't help but rant when I'm talking about stuff that interests me. Everyone did a lot to help Sorry this all about work that. out. Just focus on resting up. You don't have to worry about anything else. And seriously, well done. Oh, wow. I wasn't even aware that... Um, I didn't even know that Nijima had a cognitive version of Akechi in her palace. I, I didn't even know that. I'm gonna head back then. <sighs> yeah, yeah, we'll head to bed. Don't worry, Sojiro. Guess he won't be going to school for a while. Yeah, sucks. Don't worry about it. This'll be a breeze compared to what we've had to face so far. Are you sure about that? And we'll have all the time to come up with the plans together. We have until the 18th of next month. To be perfectly honest, I don't really care what happens to Shido, one way or the other. But when I consider the fact that he's your enemy, I naturally think he's my enemy as well. He's the enemy of the fan of thieves, man. Especially Futaba. I'm going Futaba. to stay with you until the very end. We know. Well then, we should get to sleep. You know, something that Futaba said before. What? When you were in a pinch in the palace, she picked up a reading of someone ah. who came to your rescue. Was that... I think you know. So it was Yoshizawa. Then we'd better let her know you're safe now. Yeah, I probably should text her or something, huh? And I'll even lend you a hand with that. What? Cat, what are you planning? He got what he is- Wow! Damn, dude! Apparently, Akechi arrested the leader of the Phantom Thieves. 
He's a hero. I'm so glad Akechi's back. I hope I can catch the rest of the Phantom Thieves too. He really is amazing. Cat, what are you planning? Take your time. I'd rather not. Hi, Ryuji. There's no point in even having an election. Shido's gonna win. Of course, he's the only reliable politician there is. Plus, the current government has been getting wrapped up in scandal after scandal. Even more importantly, there's just an aura about him. Like he can fix whatever problems we have. Honestly, it doesn't really matter to me who does it. I just want to see our society back on track. Especially after it turned out those phantom thieves were nothing more than scum in the end. Wow. We'll show you. Oh, we'll show all of them. All of Japan's gonna know about the phantom thieves and Cheeto. I heard you went home, so I announced it during homeroom. Are you okay? I am. Thanks. You're alive! The news is reporting you committed suicide. Call me when you can. I was so confused, but as long as you're safe... Don't worry about school, just take care of yourself. God, Kawakami, you're really... Kawakami, thanks for worrying about us. Is it true that the leader of the Phantom Thieves died? How could they let him commit suicide in jail? They really need to keep, get their shit together. Cut that out! Quiet down, you're in class! Break's time, break time's been over for... Wow, I'm, I can't read. I swear, you're like monkeys in a zoo. Hmm? Oh yeah. I received word from Kudus' family that he'll be uh, absent for a bit. Jeez. What do you people think school is, anyway? It's almost time. What are you talking about? It's morning! You still have your afternoon classes as well! Hey, it can't be true, can it? Please tell me you're okay. No problems here. Oh, thank God you're safe! That suicide report was all over the news and Miss Kawakami said you went back to your hometown. I was honestly worried about contacting you. Even Sakamoto was dodging the question when I tried to ask him. But don't worry, I won't tell anyone. By the way, the fan site is a real mess right now. But I'll keep supporting you from the shadows. Good luck! I just got a chat from Oya. Yeah, so like, the, the, the confidants that you have maxed out by this point in time, the non-party confidants, are gonna text you and check in on you and make sure you're alive. Because, you know, they just saw on TV that the leader of the Phantom Thieves is dead. And they know you're a Phantom Thief. Some crazy stuff is going on with the Phantom Thieves. Are you okay? I'm fine. Really? That's good. It's chaos over here just because of the Phantom Thieves. You're still alive, so you must be scheming something, right? I gotta prepare myself for one more mountain. But I'm glad you're okay. I'm busy, so I'll talk to you again later. Hey. You don't need to worry about it in here, but don't try not to do anything to draw attention. Anyway, today's a day off, so eat your curry and take it easy. You take your time with it, too. It's not like any customers are going to be showing up. Are you sure about that? Okay. I tried to think of the keyword, but yeah. But what about Kasumi? We need to check in on Kasumi. Yeah, what about Kasumi? Have you guys figured out the keyword to Shido's palace yet? I've tried all sorts of stuff, but no luck so far. It is hard to understand the thought process of a criminal like him. Criminal mastermind like him. You know, I've been wondering, if he's behind all those mental shutdowns, doesn't that mean all the weird accidents from the few last few years were his fault? Like that subway accident back in April? Now that you mention it, that accident lost the Minister of Transport his job. Wait, are you trying to say Shido caused that accident? What is the subway? Does he not care at all about innocent lives? That man seems to be truly unbelievable. Supposedly, there are tons of victims from that ho in the hospital still now. Masayoshi Shido. How many people has he killed over the years? What? How can we ever understand what goes on in the mind of such a horrible man? Hey, wouldn't it be faster if we just go there and try to think about it on site? Let's try that. If we're going, I'd like Akira to join too, but... Will that be okay? Won't somebody spot him there? Eh, we'll probably figure out the keyword in no time once we're there. Plus, I can throw off anyone who ta tails us with my blazing speed. All right, let's have Akira Quinn join us then. Remember, though, we're not—we're going with the intent of not being seen. Okay. Well, let's meet in front of the Diet Building and force that bastard's palace open. All right. Let's head to the Diet Building. Make sure you aren't discovered, okay? Well, what about Kasumi? What about Kasumi? 
Don't just not answer my question. What about Kasumi? You going out? Maybe. That's the plan. You gotta be kidding me. No. You realize you're done for if you get caught, right? Yes. No. Just the stunts you pull sometimes. There's things more important right just now. Don't stay out too late. Don't worry. We'll be back before dinner. Can I have, like change my settings real quick? No. Okay. Cool. Okay, she isn't here. Let's begin at once. Police cars are making rounds, so we can't stay here too long. Yeah, it's suspicious to have a bunch of high schoolers right outside the diet building. We already have Masayo Shishido and diet building. All we need is what he thinks of this place. Maybe Mount Fuji, since it's the highest place in the country? What kind of palace would Mount Fuji make, I wonder? What about a mansion? Since he's going to subjugate everyone as prime minister, perhaps a school? A prison! What about an arena, like the Colosseum? Imperial Palace? How long have we been here? Good. I thought we would have gained entry by now. Maybe we shouldn't have called you here. No, really, it's fine. Hey, you think he's guarding his whole palace with a barrier? How? What? Shido stole the cognitive science research, right? Well, maybe it had some special move written in it. Ryuji? Is that even possible? I doubt it. It has to do with a person's cognition. Who knows? I've got no idea. There was nothing like that in the notes I saw. Anyways, what kind of person is Shido? I can't figure him out. I did some light research on him last night, but I couldn't get a grasp on the type of... Yeah, he's, he's a politician. His, like, half of his history should be on the internet somewhere. On? That man over there is probably a legislator, right? I'll try asking him. Is that really a good idea? Hold on, is that a good idea? Excuse me, I'm a member of the newspaper club at my high school. May I speak with you for a moment? Sure. What kind of person is Representative Shido? What's he think about the national diet? His stance is dedication for country. It's how he's garnered everyone's trust. He's an admirable man of action, with a first-class determination. I'd say he's a model politician. I believe that he'll help create a wonderful future in which young adults like you can live in ease. That wasn't helpful. An exemplary answer. Yeah, I read right from a textbook. It makes sense he wouldn't tell teenagers anything unnecessary. Look over there. He's on a walkie-talkie. He's a security, what do you expect? Wait, is it about us? It might be, we've been here for a while. That doesn't look good. We should leave at once. Tomorrow's a day off, so let's have an early strategy meeting. Meet at LeBlanc, okay? Let me mess with my settings real quick. You Everything's too bright. This tonight. On camera, at least. Can I mess with my settings now? Fuck's sake. The criminals calling themselves the Phantom Thieves are no more. However, I believe that this country's citizens are still living their days in anxiety. These scandals only increase our distrust of the current government. As a citizen myself, I am enraged. Look who's talking. What does it mean to be a politician with responsibility? Say what you will about Shido, he's good at acting here. Consideration of the country I guess most politicians outrageous. are. The election's public notification is tomorrow. No matter where I go, people are cheering for Shido. Everyone's being deceived so easily. Oh boy. I tried looking up Shido's interviews online. They all sound so goddamn fake. I checked his profile as well, but I couldn't find much outside his title and education. He's currently 53. Exactly! He's 53 years old! He's talking about how everybody's an old man. Come on, dude. You're not that young. He's gone from being a metro metropolitan assemblyman to a representative. Though he's a cabinet member, he split from the ruling party to form the United Future Party. Shido's a cabinet minister? For real? He was specially appointed to the position, that's his current title. Apparently he almost won also won a contest for 
who people would most like to have as their boss. Even the news sites write about him as though he's assured to become Prime Minister. If only we could find out the meaning behind Shido's words. In order to save this country that has been tainted by villains, social reform is essential. Yeah, but not your social reform. We all need social reform right now, but not yours, Shido. Shido's reputation truly is astronomical. It's preposterous. This isn't the popularity level of a normal politician anymore. What's so great about him? I seriously don't get it. He's a strong leader who protects his citizens. Well, supposedly. Is everyone blind? We just need to shed light on who he really is. By the way, is it okay if my sister joins us tomorrow? She's hoping she could be of help as well. Fine by me? Okay, I'll tell her that. We'll figure out the keywords tomorrow for sure. That's the hope. What about Kasumi? Mm. What's with all the love for Shido? I get that no one knows the truth about him, but it still creeps me out. Also, look at look at the, the, the poster. You have a fan of these poster. Ah, it's so nice. Anyway, um, let me change my brightness back to. That's not what I want. Like, I guess we're going all the way back down here. It doesn't really matter, considering we don't go to school anymore. And this looks great on camera, even though I can't see that well in real life. Also, why can't we use the third eye in real life? It makes no sense. Why are we able to use that in real life? I doubt I can do anything. Oh, I can! Let's play a game. Da, da, da. Alright, I'm gonna need to button mash again, so I better get ready. Okay. That was not hard. 40 times? Eh, that's not hard. Don't even need to try for that, man. <laughs> oh. Come on, almost rank 5 guts. <laughs> now that you put an end to the case, it's just like Shido-san said. We can't go wrong leaving things to Masayoshi Shido. Shido-san's gonna be in this election too, right? Politicians like him are promising. Are you sure about that? So he has to be guilty? Yeah, sure. Y'all, you'll see. As your physician, I would like to confirm something. Please contact me as soon as you see this. I'm still alive. Stop making me worried. I'm glad you're okay. I just got nervous when I saw the news. Well, I'll be at, I'll be at the clinic if you need any medicine. <sighs> it's nothing but the Phantom Thieves on TV. Oh, that's right. Aren't you all supposed to be gathering here today? Yup. Make sure you finish eating before everyone shows up. Yeah. I guess you gotta close up early today, huh? It's almost time for our media. I wonder if anyone figured out the keyword. Probably not. <laughs> Ryuji? Diamond mine. Ryuji, Futaba, are you two okay? <sighs> Nothing. No Ryuji and Futaba look like they're about to just like keel over and die. How many do we miss? <sighs> Perhaps he truly does have a barrier up. That's impossible! It's a person's cognition! You can't block everybody yelling from your cognition. Or at least not completely right? like that. No, Ryuji. That's not something to be excited about. You know all the way up to Diet Building, too. Just this one word. So you enter keywords into the Metaverse Navigator. Yep. Boss, can you turn the TV on? Shido might be on it. Sure thing. That's catchy. Girl, catchy. Him and his stupid composed face. <laughs> Everybody just so hates everyone yourself. right now. Is it true you withdrew yourself from the media as part of your plan to capture the Phantom Thieves? I truly apologize for causing such a stir. Honestly, it required a lot of courage to openly oppose them when their popularity was at its peak. Just like toot your own horn real quick. I mean, people often lashed out at me online and whatnot. Then was it also your plan when you said they weren't at fault after their popularity declined? Bruh, all of this was part of his plan. That was to catch them off guard. I could say I applied my profiling knowledge. Once they lost public support, Someone they thought was their greatest enemy led to hand. That's the same strategy used in romance, wouldn't you agree? 
Who the hell are you romancing with that strategy? I want to know. Why is he being treated as an ace detective of justice? Because no one knows shit besides us. Not just on TV or online. Newspapers, magazines. I see his face everywhere. On the other hand, no one's hoping for our comeback on the fan site. Like, at all. I doubt that. I doubt that. There's always, there's always those couple of people that are like blind believers no matter what goes on. There's got to be at least a couple of those regarding the Phantom Thieves. Phantom Thieves are evil. Shido and Akechi are just. It should be the other way around. We can't do anything about that though. They're manipulating information using the media. Yeah, that's what people do all the time. Leaving Akechi aside, we'll get back at him later. Our main issue is Shido. Right. Were there any instances before when you didn't know the palace keywords? Uh. Well, there was the time with Futaba. That, oh yeah, that was hard. We didn't know anything about her, so all we could do was make conjectures. We had to ask her directly. Then why don't we just go directly and see Shido? That's that is a, yeah, that's a terrible idea. He's surrounded by bodyguards and followers all the time. There's no way high school students can get an appointment with him either. Well, we do have an adult with us. Nijua? No, that's still impossible. Besides, that's too dangerous a method. <sighs> well, this is a problem. It's with a ruckus outside. Yeah, what is the ruckus Sorry, outside? It's Shido! Isn't that an election campaign car? Yeah, it's Shido, goddammit! Oh, right! The candidates are currently campaigning! That voice. I apologize for the commotion. I am a Sayoshi Shido. Wait, did he just say Shido? Yeah. Yeah, he did! Go, 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 go! It sounds like the same voice I heard back then. Mm -hmm. Man, talk about being lucky! <laughs> we can go check him out without an appointment now! Yeah, let's go find him. Hold on, wait! Guys, wait! Hey, Ryuji ran off toward the station. Yep, so did Haru. This way, hurry! And by the way, did something happen? We didn't seem well a moment ago. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. It's nothing. Now is the time to rebuild this crumbling nation. Yeah, by the way, like... Okay, never mind. I'll mention it in a bit. The criminals have taken a strong foothold in our society. Such a disgraceful past must be discarded. We must set sail into a new future of dreams and hope. Set sail, huh? Come on. Can you like shut up? I'm trying to progress things here. I wonder what people think is the best country in the world right now. Curious as to what people think about that right now. I humbly ask that you cast your vote for me, Masayoshi Shido. Let us all set sail toward a happy future, together. I hope to continue serving you all. Is that the guy? You guys wait here. I'll go get intel for us. Ryuji, wait. Hey, yo, Shido-san! Ryuji! Stand back. I just want to talk to him for a sec. He's a busy man. The hell? Ain't he supposed to hear a citizen's comments? Ryuji? That's enough, Brad. You're that asshole we met at the hotel before. At the elevators. Yeah, and? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? What are you talking about? They're not going to remember you, you know. That moron. Come on, stop. But these guys... Ryuji? Hey, kid. You don't want to know what happens when you cross me. That voice. It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? 
take a show. Get lost, you kid. Damn it, brat! I'll sue! This man. There's no mistake. He's the same man from, as the one from before. What are you looking at? Uh, nothing. This country is filled with clueless children. I worry for Japan's future. Let them go. My next appointment is coming up. Shit just got personal. Shit. So what do you think after seeing him in person? But yeah, like, we knew. We knew, and like, people, they're saying like, oh yeah, the reason Akira couldn't remember who Shido was before was because the drugs fucked up his mind and couldn't remember anything. But at the same time, like, you know what, it's whatever. But yeah, we already knew. I'm pretty sure you guys already knew. He's why I got arrested. He's why I got arrested. Wait, he's the jerk you told us about before? Yup. The same guy? For real? Seriously? Yup. You're sure, aren't you? One hundred percent. She is the one who ruined your life. Yup. Holy shit. I don't believe it. <sighs> Yeah, no, the hate I feel for Shido is so, like, it's crazy the amount of hate I feel for Shido. Let's get going. And another okay. politician that's currently running this country that I live in right now. Shido's the guy who set you up? What kind of fate brought you two back together? It's a giant game, all this shit. It's definitely him. Talk about a destined connection. Shido was involved in the cognitive research too, right? This can't be dismissed as just a coincidence. Definitely not. God, what the hell's going on here? Ryuji's face! Ryuji's face! Oh my god! Ryuji, keep your eyes in your sockets. Shido was already a politician then. Yet he sued a student and ruined his future? Yeah, and got false charges on us. He must have pulled some strings so that his name wouldn't be mentioned. He did exactly that. Furthermore, he also would have had to force that woman into making a false statement. He did that too. He would do anything. We're talking about a man who ordered a hit inside the That's station. true. He can't sit still until he crushes whoever opposes him, no matter how trivial. He's always been that way. Always, what huh? He's a piece of shit. Children are the future, my ass! What he's saying and doing are completely different! You gotta keep up that public image as a politician. Can't something be done about his record? There's no evidence. Once the courts have made a judgment, overturning that decision will be difficult. It'd barely be possible even if proof of innocence is presented and Shido admits to his crimes. At any rate, we need to trigger a change of heart in him. Be that as it may. Shido's outer appearance and his true face are wholly different. Completely. It's beyond hypocritical. It's as if he's an entirely different person. He speaks about the good of the country. It makes me wonder what really is on his mind. That man's full of ambition to rise in the world. He only thinks of the weak as stepping stools for his success. He treats himself as an elite man while looking down on others the worst. I assume the key word for what he believes the diet building is will be despicable too. You sure about that? It must be something self-centered and completely different from politics. Yeah. Yeah. Someone like him needs to be punished as soon as possible. Me who already knows keywords, like, oh yeah, it is. <laughs> Let's head to the diet building again right after school tomorrow. I feel we'll get it this time. Couldn't Akira just like anywhere. sleep in all day until school is over and then head over to the diet building? Akira could totally ruin his sleep schedule. Just saying. The guy behind everything turned out to be your arch enemy. What an oddly poetic twist. Yeah. Oh yeah, those clothes. You'd stand out if everyone was wearing their school uniform. It might be a good idea to wear a uniform when you head out. Yeah, we're gonna probably end up doing that. Can I watch DVD? Nope. Can uh oh no, I can't play a game. I finished that game yesterday. Um, I have books to read. I probably can't go outside though, because Soichiro's being overprotective. Shiro this, Shiro that. 
The world's gone to hell. Yeah, can I go outside, please? Hey! Damn it. Okay, let's read. Hey! Yeah, do I have anything for... Ah, nothing for guts. Make oh well. I'm gonna skip through this. Alright, what do we unlock? Seaside Park! Ah, oh, it's like six... Not six right. flags. What's that one in Texas? In... Shoot, I forget what it's called. Whatever. It seems there'll be a higher voter turnout this election. It will totally be an easy win for Shido-kun. He really got famous from all that fan of Thieves business. He's on track to become Prime Minister. I guess I should be on Shido's side. Well, hold on. Don't just go along with the flow. If your opinion differs from the others, then stick to that opinion. Akechi got the last laugh. I have a, I've actually been paying attention to the news lately. Aren't you proud of me? Don't you... Don't you leave it on hoping Akechi will be there? Well, not that I blame you. He's a real hero. I think Masayoshi Shido is even more amazing, though. He's the first politician I've ever believed in. Oh, I know Shido-san, too. Sounds like he really wants to improve the country. Can't they see they're being lied to? We have to do something! Yeah, politicians lie all the time, but if it's a good lie, then people will believe it. Just because they want to. It's not true that the leader of the Fan Thieves died, right? Everything's fine. Thank goodness. There's no way the Fan Thieves could be defeated. Man, it's such a relief to hear things are okay. Well, if you need anything, I'll be at the arcade. Do, 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 do. Ba, ba, ba. Ba, ba. The fan of Thieves have been on the news recently, so... I was wondering how you're doing. Are you going to give up without accomplishing your goal? No problems here. So you're okay? That's a relief. I'm expecting great things from the fan of Thieves. If you need anything, if you need anything, I'm happy to help, my comrade. Mm. It feels pretty weird seeing you around on a weekday. You're taking off tonight, right? Sheesh, you're such a risk taker. Listen, make sure nobody notices you, okay? I make no promises except that I'll try my best. We have to do something about the keyword for sure this time, and we will. We'll figure it out sooner or later. Do, do, do. Security guards became suspicious of us last time, so we can't stay here for long. But we still have no hit. It's gotta be something. Think it's a barrier after all? No, it's not a barrier, Ryuji. Where'd your enthusiasm from yesterday go? Ah, shut up. The real game starts at two outs. But that doesn't even make sense. You should only be thinking about the keyword. The citizens are secondary. He only cares about his own well-being and that of his lackeys. Not even his lackeys. He killed he the SIU director. Prime Minister, even if it means trampling on others. Fortune, rich people. Hey, can you think of anything based on what you've heard from him? Just try saying anything. It doesn't matter if you guess. Me, huh? Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Steer? He also said yesterday that he's, we need to set sail. Is it a ship? It was a match? What? The diet building's a ship? Oh, you'll see. You'll what see. What kind of scenery will that be? The actual building's on land. You'll see. You'll I see. Just calm down. Imagine what it will be like. Just calm down for a second. You'll see what well, everything's whatever like. Whatever it is, looks like there are no barriers. Poor Ryuji. Oh, sh shut up! Let's hurry up and go in. Yeah, yeah. Are we clear of the guard's sight? We should probably move. Get closer to the wall, just in case. All right, do it. All right, in we go. Okay, I'm gonna stop. All right, this place. This place. Did anything change? We went in, right? Security guards seem to be gone, but it's difficult to tell for certain. Look at Morgana! He's not a cat! This seems to be similar to what happened with Sis's palace. But this time, the Dyer building remains unchanged. Uh, 
The gate wasn't open earlier, though. Wait, look! Mona's appearance is different. We're definitely inside the palace. That means we're definitely in a palace. Hey, you took my words out. Come on, yeah, Tava. You can't look. just... You can't do that. I'm gonna keep quiet while this happens. How's it Ooh, look nice music. See anything? Nah, it's totally normal. I'll check it out. Huh? What the heck? What's up, Futaba? <laughs> Futaba? What is it? <sighs> the hell? Huh? The Dyed Building is a ship! Big one as well, it's like a cruise ship almost. It is basically a cruise ship. Even though this country may sink, he alone will survive. That's what this cognition is about, huh? Basically. Yeah, this is on a scale completely different than anything else. Oh, shit. A country that children can be proud of my ass is completely sunken in his head. If a guy like this stands above everyone, we're seriously done for. That's why we're here. This is beyond ridiculous. The same goes for Akechi. He should have seen this scenery as well. Yet he still aided Shido. Yeah. What in the world is he thinking? He has another plan. Come on, it's Goro Akechi. He has a different plan. Whether it be for glory, or for simply a reward, my father died because of someone like this. We gotta sink Shido instead of this country. Right. A palace with not just the center of the distortion, but the entire country sunken. I can't believe there's someone with this tremendous of a desire. Crazy, right? Be careful. This will be completely different from past palaces. Literally just a couple of days ago you said this is gonna be a breeze. We're definitely gonna take his treasure. Let's go! Alright! We must put an end to this by December 17th, the day before the elections. Right. Let the infiltration begin! So we've so got... I am back for setting us up into 24 trap. days? Give or take? I think it's about 20... What? So plus 7... Wait. Plus 17... Yeah, we got about 24 days. Shouldn't I could have been disguising myself on his way here? Uh, seeing someone in disguise and a bunch of kids in school uniforms would be super weird. <laughs> yeah, if anything, this school uniform that we're wearing right now is the best disguise we could have had. <laughs> Alright. So, Shido's Palace. Uh, you, you. Shido's Palace. This place is long, it's convoluted. But truth be told, that final boss is not going to be very difficult. So let's just head straight in and do some investigation, why don't we? Indeed. Masayo Shishido's palace. I wonder what awaits us within. Let's go find out. It's time we begin our infiltration. For some reason, we can just go through the front doors. I don't know why. For some reason, that's allowed. There we go. Um... I understand why he might already see us as a threat, but why are even the passengers wearing masks? Uh... You think they're trying to be fan of thieves like Noir was with that beauty thief stuff? <laughs> but that's... That's quite enough. It looks like. Whatever the reason, it reflects Shido's mentality. Surely he doesn't view others normally. You're right. Given the insane nature of this distortion, I'm surprised they even look like people. Yeah, you guys remember fucking Kanashiro? Listen up. It's very likely that we'll end up in battles from here forward. Be on your guard, everyone. Oh, yeah. We don't need to worry about that too much, though. I have a feeling we're gonna get kicked out of this palace pretty quickly. Huh? Joker, an enemy! Ugh, is it attacking us with all these people around? Keep in mind, they're not real. They're probably gonna watch and be like, Oh, it's another day in business. I'm gonna turn down the volume because it's getting loud for me. Sorry. Alright, let's get this. Aren't you with the fire? Damn, Fox, you good? 
Never mind, you're probably not weak against fire then. Box? Oh, I was hoping for a thingy, but oh uh, yeah. Cool. 55. Damn it! For uh, fuck's sake, fine! I didn't know this guy's past fight as a mini boss. Alright, you're weak to ice. Pretty sure I have someone with ice here. Bufula. Bufula. Okay. 28. 20. Okay. Need to check. Power. Alright, this should finish it, and if not, then Ryuji can finish it. Alright. I love Joker's oh, attack scheme, man. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, is this a show of sorts? Mr. Shido never fails to keep his guests entertained. Indeed. Those privileged enough to be on this ship are all on the winning team. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like the end. These people. Why do they not feel any danger after what they just witnessed? Because they're not a part. They're not directly involved. Seems they think no harm will come to them because they're here on Shido's ship. That too. They're not even sensing the danger. <sighs> come on, let's make him see what this ship really is. Yeah, that's easier said than done, Ryuji. That's much easier said than done. I also want to see. Oh, oh fuck's sake! I didn't even see that guy. I never saw him coming. Uh, you cannot use shadow factorization. When you highlight a shadow, a target in battle, you'll be able to see which attacks are null, repelled, and drained. However, if an enemy's attribute affinities are displayed as question mark, the attack stats of the attack will not be shown. Weakness to nuclear. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, fuck's sake! I am down. You're asleep. <laughs> She's <laughs> the freaking the shadow right over there is asleep. All right, let's see. Nuclear, huh? Do we have anyone with nukes? I don't think I have anyone with nukes. Fuck's sake! All right, well, might as well use my best guy. Ah, that's a fuck's sake. Big boom! Big boom! Oh, will you join my team now? Let me your power. Yes. Thanks, Cerberus. Jeez. Also, I was under the impression that Cerberus has uh mask, three heads and not one. At least that's what friggin' Disney's Hercules test told me. Okay, so. <laughs> Now that that's out of the way, let's get this treasure chest. And that, it looks like there's one over there. There, it looks like there's one over there as well. Jeez, I don't know why I can't speak English today. Shadow, what do you want to do, Joker? What do you mean? What do you want to do? Let's just ambush the guy. What did Kutama say? Kutama was about to say something. And I just completely. Ooh, yeah! Bullet hail! Let's go! Okay, yeah, and that's why. That's why. You do Shinya's. <laughs> that, my friends, is why you uh, you do Shido's. Not Shido's. Shinya's social link. Because you can learn skills like that with your guns, and it comes in handy. Just like I thought. Ba ba da ba ba. All right. Okay. Down to zero. Easier than cleaning my brushes. Cleaning brushes can be hard, especially like like if they're brushes that have had paint on them for a while, then it can be kind of hard to clean them up properly. Alright, I need to head upstairs. Alright. No! <laughs> I was gonna, oh wait, I need to heal a Yusuke! God damn it! Again? Yes! Yeah, so you just spam the X button and you can hit everybody all at once with your guns. It's nice. Alright. Nice. Oh, block. Lame. You have rank 3. Everybody else is rank 2. I should probably go play darts with them. No. 
<laughs> Let's not make that mistake again. Why don't I just go for this? Nice. Looking good, Joker. Herbris. Soul Drop! Soul Drop and Experience? Nice. Good work, everyone. Good work, everyone. Alright. Oh, oh man. Man, oh man, oh man. Alright, this guy's weak when he's coming this way. I need to heal Fox, God! Every time I just keep forget again. Let's go. The amount of times I've gone freaking down, not down, not down shot. I forget what it's called. I forget what it's called, but you know this ability. The amount of times I've gone at this point, I, I'm I'm quite honestly shocked that. I've gone this like bullet hail every time so far. Minus that one time we were almost attacked. Okay. And obviously the mini boss. Child's play. Yeah, you can say that. There's gotta be something here. That's an enemy over there, isn't it? Nope, that's what is that? There was something over here. Was there something over there? Whatever. Let's just keep going. Gotta be careful though. Okay, he's on the other side, so I think it's fine. The door's right here though, so we can just head straight on through. We need to find a map. And I need to heal Fox! I need to heal Fox. Okay. Now what? Hmm. This is. I can sense the treasure's presence. I thought this was gonna be a voice scene. Never mind. It's that way. Let's go, guys. All right, sweet. Straight through these doors, and that's the treasure. These huge doors are obviously suspicious. I wonder what's through here. There are slots to stick in something like a key card. Whoa, there's five of them. Gotta have to break through. Four hundred seventy-five people in favor. Zero against. I hear something. Since there is no one against the plan, this bill will be unanimously passed as drafted. Passed? What's going on? Is that Shiro's voice? What bill? If this truly is the representative's chamber as written, beyond here must be the main assembly hall. What bill? The what now? It's that large conference room that's usually seen on the news. The one that sits like 50 million people. Oh, that thing! Gotcha! Not 50 million. So, what are they doing inside? Most likely a meaningless vote. One in which whatever Shido proposes will always go unopposed. Yep, but what's the bill? So he's doing whatever he wants by keeping only his supporters in there. Sounds familiar, doesn't it? What do we do to get in, though? Should we find these key cards? That's what we gotta do, don't we? Maybe we need some kind of qualification. One that vows to be his follower or swear loyalty. If you think we're swearing loyalty, that's an so obit. basically we need to prove that we're on his side. We'll have to pretend. You sure move on quick. Well, What's duh. What's qualification thing about? If we have to, then we have to. Why don't we ask the guests on this ship? That's dangerous. No, it's not. No, it's not. Asking around doesn't sound like a bad idea. The guests here are the cognitive versions of them in Shido's mind. They'll know any secrets he shared. True. <sighs> All right, time to go on a scavenger hunt so once again. The ruler here is that evil Shido. It wouldn't surprise me if they did turn hostile. Right. Uh, yeah, uh, wouldn't they attack us? Uh, da, da, da. We should prepare for the worst, of course. But I think we'll at least be able to talk to them. Yeah, they're not gonna attack the us. They're just normal people. Arc loaded with those that Shido believes are worth keeping alive. It'd explain the luxury cruise ship. I doubt idiots who can't even hold a conversation would be here. He's right about that. We can at least gather information. It helps that everyone's wearing masks. We'll blend in even with our attire. Our clothing is weird. The masks help, I guess. To anyone else, just like him. 
something. That's what goes really on in the world of politics, though. No one really shows, shows their true face. No one really shares their real thoughts. Most of the time, at least. Well, it looks like everyone's taken off to go gather intel. There's no doubt. I can sense a treasure behind this door. Looks like you've already hit the jackpot. Let's go talk to the others. Yeah, we'll do that next time. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this so far. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!